further assessment of the CNC circuit mill here, we're talking about decoupling the axis drive here, these shafts, from the frame to make the fabrication easier. Because the frame is relatively easy to make and it's very stable. How would we decouple the drive from the frame? So essentially what I'm thinking is to explain the concept of decoupling the axis components from the frame itself. You see we have these precision holes here. Mm -hmm. And essentially what I want to do is, if I want to be replicating this again with the same manufacturing process, I would have to use two templates. One template as long as this long angle and one template short as this short angle. Mm -hmm. So that's not good. I, for precision, I want to be using one template per axis to ensure precision. Mm -hmm. So what I want to do is, instead of having this long angle, which is part of the frame, be part of the axis such as this, I want to instead say rotate the side and have some the platform like a flat platform like that and have an angle, a short angle similar to this, mounted on here with the same holes that you see here and there. A short piece of, um, a short of piece frame of su superimposed on this, so. Exactly. Uh -huh. But now the question is, how do I mount the new short angle onto this frame piece, right? And then mm -hmm. I was initially thinking uh, bolts and nuts and washers, but there's another method that involves clamping and that could involve much faster modularity.